gives you advice, yeah, on how to live your life, how to live your life. Don't you know that life is full of surprises? You better realize. Better hey guys, so I am about to take a pregnancy test. Um, today would make it. Let's see, where did I put the big one? Um, today would make me. I think nine days, nine DPO. Um, and I'm not really, we didn't really like try for this month. I just, I stopped taking my birth control and we did, um, you know, do it a couple of days that I was supposedly ovulate, ovulating, but not like the main day. Um, and I, I, I'm probably not pregnant. Also these um, little tests the, this is the Equate Digital Pregnancy Test. I have two of these and I also have two like super cheap ones from the dollar store. Um, but I'm only 9 DPO right now, but I figured I will go ahead and take one just in case. Um, although I feel like it won't, you know, show up this early if I was pregnant, which I'm probably not because we didn't really try try this month. Um, and depending, you know, if my period does come later this month and like when it does come because my period is always pretty wishy-washy. Um, depends on if, like, you know, we want to conceive or if we want to try to conceive next month. I honestly am just basing, um, like, when we're trying to conceive off of what would be the due date around the time. Just, like, just because I want to know and I want to make sure it's an okay time for, like, us, for our family. You know, especially for Parker. I want to put him into a lot of consideration in this. But, yeah, I am going to go ahead and just take one of these um, Equate Digital Pregnancy Tests. It didn't have very good reviews online, um, but I mean, we're just gonna take one. So I'm gonna go ahead and pee on it, and then I think you have to wait like three minutes, so I'll cover it, and then I'll you know, undo it with you guys. And if it says not pregnant, I think I will go ahead and open it up, because I know a lot of people said, you know, just because this isn't the greatest brand, uh, it's the Walmart brand, I'll open it up. Um, and see, and if I am pregnant, then you guys, you know, get that reaction. Okay, so I covered it with this. I think that it has been three minutes though, so let's. Mm, okay. Well, it says not pregnant, which really bumps me out. I'm gonna go ahead and open this and see. Okay, so <clears throat> I'm low key, like, pretty disappointed. Just because I don't like seeing, you know, negative signs, of course, when you know that you want a baby and you're trying to conceive. Even though this was the first month and we didn't really try try. But I mean, still, we knew that it was a possibility, you know. Um, but, yeah, I took it apart and there, I didn't see another line. But again, I'm only 9 DPO. Um, so, I'm going to take another test. Hey guys, um, so sorry if you can hear the toilet, um, I just did my morning urine, but <clears throat> today is 11 DPO, so 11 days past ovulation, and I'm about to take another pregnancy test. This test I am taking first thing in the morning, and if it's negative, then I'm pretty like darn sure that I'm not pregnant for this month. Um, I had a dream last night that I was pregnant and it made me wake up in like a happy mood. So I'm gonna be extremely bummed. Um, I don't wanna cry, why am I starting to cry? Ugh. I don't wanna be bummed out if I'm not pregnant this month. Like I said, um, when I took the other one, we're, we weren't like super, super trying this month, but we did, you know, know that I was off birth control and we did, um, you know, have sex on the days that I was considered to be ovulating, just I don't think the day that I was like max ovulating. Um, but yeah, so I have my TMI, but I have my urine in this cup. And I'm gonna take a first response test this time. Um, so like I said, if it's negative, then it's most, you know, likely that I'm not pregnant this month and I should be starting my period. Um, eventually, uh, this is the kind that is supposed to tell you up to five days sooner than your missed period. Um, so yeah, we're going to go ahead and take it and I'm going to set the timer. But like I said, you guys, I had a dream that I was pregnant. So, okay, so you're supposed to dip it in there, I think, for like 
five seconds. Let me make sure. Um, yeah. Five seconds and then wait three minutes. So I'll set a timer. So, ready? One, two, three, four, five. gonna put that on and set it over there with the little thing covering it and then just started the timer so when it gets to three minutes I will turn you guys back on and look and see if there's a faint line or anything there if it's not I'm gonna be really bummed if it is I'm gonna be really excited so we'll see okay guys so it's been four minutes so I'm gonna go ahead and get the test and I do not see any line, which gives me like this ugh, feeling in my chest. And we'll go ahead and show you guys even though there is no, there's no line. I don't know if it'll, There's definitely not even like a slight pink and I know people can go crazy like trying to find <sighs> trying to find the pink this bumps me out well Well, hopefully, you know, moving forward, we've never um, tried to, like, conceive a baby or anything. Parker wasn't something that we were trying for. He was, um, and we were, you know, younger, so we weren't trying to have a baby at that point in our lives. But now, um, we're older. Parker's, you know, almost about to be two and a half. So, I feel like we're ready for another baby. But, I guess this month is, you know, not baby time don't Ugh. I don't want to cry because like we weren't like super trying and like I don't know my husband thinks it's going to be super easy to make a baby I know a lot of people have a lot of trouble with that and that's just you know kind of how life goes and you know we'll see what our you know TTC journey is going to be like but this is you know just the beginning and we already have one very lovely beautiful handsome the most amazing kid ever so yeah i mean we'll see what happens next month hopefully you know fingers crossed you guys but thank you guys for watching um and you know becoming a part of this new journey in our lives this new ttc journey my husband said if i said these kind of words like um dbo and uh, ttc on my channel he was gonna make fun of me because he feels like they're not real words um <laughs> But yeah, thank you guys so much for watching and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye guys.